Matt Shane Sarnes here with DroidMotorX.com. Many of you guys may have heard that Google has been working on updated versions of their Google apps. One of those is Gmail. Gmail has been updated or it is in the works of being updated to 4.2. In the new version of Gmail, there's all kinds of features like pinch to zoom. That's finally coming to Gmail and also uh, you can swipe to delete. Now it has been leaked. Uh, it's not out officially, but if you have root on your Android device and you have root explorer, then you can uh, change some files and you can have 4.2 uh, on your Android device. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. You want to be sure to head to the link in the description and grab the Gmail 4.2 application. Put that on your SD card. And then, like I said, you'll need to be rooted and you'll need to have a file manager like root explorer that has read write capability. So we'll go ahead and open up Root Explorer. Uh, before you do anything, go ahead and make sure that you make a Nandroid backup of your device. If you don't know how to do that, check out my channel. I've got several tutorials on how to do that for uh, several different Android devices. It pretty much works the same on every device, though. Uh, as long as you have a custom recovery, you can make an Android backup. What an Android backup is, is just a backup of your entire uh, system, including uh, all your applications, all your app data, and uh, everything about your phone would be completely backed up in case uh, for some reason this doesn't take, uh, which it should if you follow directions. So you'll, you'll go into your system folder and then uh, app, so system app, and you're looking for any Gmail related applications. And what we're going to do is just delete these. So Gmail APK is there. You may have even more than what I have. So see we have to mount read write and then we can delete. And we'll go to the next one that's Gmail, delete that. And then we'll just kind of scroll through here and make sure we're not missing anything. And then the next folder that we want to check is data. So we'll go back and go to data and app and then if we have any kind of gmail application here it would be like com.android.gmail if you have any of that there you'll want to go ahead and uninstall that if you're running a custom rom your gmail may be in this folder uh, so this is where you would go to delete it so as soon as you have everything deleted uh, you'll just go ahead and power off the phone or you could just reboot it And then to install the 4.2 is real easy. You'll just go to wherever it was on your SD card and you will install it like any other application. Really easy. As soon as this boots up, we will install the application. I'll show you guys some of the new features in Gmail 4.2. Okay, so if everything went according to plan, your Gmail application should be totally gone. So if you go into your app drawer, Gmail should be totally gone. Uh, so you want to go back to your file manager and find uh, that file that you downloaded. For me, it would be an SD card and download because I downloaded it directly to my phone. And it should be gmail2.apk. If it's anything other than gmail2.apk, you'll want to go ahead and rename that. Uh, so from here, you'll just install it. And you'll have to go into your settings there and check unknown sources. Then you should be able to install it. Okay, so once you're done, you can go ahead and open it. Now it's gonna give you a couple of warnings up here because you're gonna to have to give it permission to just allow access for all your accounts that you have synced up. And now your account should sync up Okay, so it's going to take a few minutes to sync up, but once it is synced up, uh, then you have several new options. A couple that are very notable here is you can swipe to delete, like so. Then you can also open up a an email and pinch to zoom. So that's something that has been missing from Gmail is pinch to zoom. And then also like that UI enhancement where you can swipe to delete. It uh, makes things so much easier, and we've grown accustomed to that in our notifications uh, just to swipe it away. Uh, so that just makes it so much easier to use and makes it look a whole lot cleaner. And uh, anyways, guys, that has been the Gmail 4.2 application. It's good for every Android device as long as you're rooted and you have... Um, as long as you're rooted 
and you have Root Explorer. Thanks guys for watching. Find more of me at DroidMotorX.com where I have the latest in Android and tech news. Be sure to follow me on Twitter at DroidMotorX. Subscribe to this channel for more coverage on Android devices. We're going to do all kinds of Roots and Mod tutorials as well as uh, product reviews and all kinds of videos like that. Uh, also be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if it helps you in any way. Guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.